Alright, what is going on guys? Willis Gaming here. We are back again with another video. A uh, very special video for you guys today. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at Ghost Recon Breakpoint. I've got some awesome gameplay for you guys of the game. If you've watched the live stream just now, you've probably seen the CGI trailer and the gameplay. In this, I guess we're going to be reacting to the gameplay, breaking it down, taking a look at the stealth elements, the customization, all that cool stuff. And yeah, this video is actually sponsored by Ubisoft as well. So I'm going to leave a pre-order link in the video description if you want to go pre-order Ghost Recon Breakpoint. The game actually releases October 4th. Um, I'm super excited to cover it on the channel. It's obviously a Ubisoft game. I love Ubisoft games like The Division, all that great stuff. But yeah, guys, I'm also going to be giving away a copy of Ghost Recon Breakpoint in this video. If you'd like to enter, leave a like on the video. Feel free to subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below. Winner will be announced in my next Ghost Recon Breakpoint video. With that being said, let's begin. Now, I've skimmed through this uh, gameplay briefly. I haven't sat down and watched it in its entirety. So I guess we're going to be uh, checking it out together. So, but yeah, in the gameplay, you're seeing the first ever gameplay of Ghost Recon at Breakpoint. Now, for those of you who are new to the channel and you've obviously subscribed from The Division, I feel like you will enjoy this game a lot. From what I've seen, this looks like a really awesome game to play. Obviously, you've got the stealth. And I think this game incorporates more of the survival aspect, so you can obviously like survive in the wild and stuff, which is really cool. Um, a cool thing is, um, I think the villain in the game, or the one of the main dudes, is John Berthel. Um, he was actually from The Punisher, or if you've watched The Walking Dead. Um, it's really cool. He makes an appearance in the CGI trailer. Definitely go check out the CGI trailer as well in the video description. I'll leave a link to that. Make sure to watch it. It's dope. I love the visual effects. It's really cool. Um, but yeah, our dude looks pretty messed up right now. He has just come out of a firefight and he's still getting shot at. Jesus. He's about to fall off this cliff. He's actually turning around to shoot. What the hell? He is pretty bloodied up. That's crazy. This game looks fantastic. Like the actual visuals, like the lighting, really cool. I'm pretty sure he slides down this hill. If you were this messed up, why would you slide down the hill? <laughs> Let's be honest. I don't know if he did this on purpose. But he is now pretty more messed up. So yeah, hopefully in the gameplay we get to see, obviously, some of the gunplay. The shooting aspects. And I think in a bit we get to see some of the uh, survival aspects of the game, which is cool. Um, you've got that stamina bar there, I guess what it is. Like fatigue. It's obviously slowly regenerating as he's crawling. I love the look of the guns in these type of games as well. Just super like, I wouldn't say futuristic, just like modern. Okay, so he's popping like a first aid kit. I think I saw like a grenade or something on that wheel as well. Okay, that's cool. So he's healing up. Bandaging up his leg there. Oh, that's really cool how it like shows on your character. So when you've actually like bandaged... It stays on your character. I don't know if that's going to be in a full game, but that'll be pretty awesome. Okay, he's aiming. I don't think they see him. So yeah, I guess we're going to get see some of the uh, stealth aspect of the game. This is cool. Take cover. There's an Azrael drone overhead. Copy that. Azrael drone. Oh, there's a drone in the sky. Dope. He's gonna do his like underwater thing, that'd be cool. Okay, so I'm pretty sure in this gameplay they um they break into a compound or something and try and steal something. Oh dear. Hey, it's a deer. <laughs> oh, it creeped me out. Look at the lighting. That's cool. Definitely a huge improvement from Wildlands. Ghost lead. This is Ghost One Two. We're on route to your location. Okay. okay, so he's got his team coming in. He's got some backup coming in. We've got our crawling. He's actually getting muddy. Check that out on the ground. You can actually see like the the mud like going down. That's really cool. So here we get to see, obviously, some of the stealth. He's covering himself in mud. Oh. 
That's cool. Oh, there's like one right next to him. Crazy. Oh, he about to stealth kill, huh? Jesus. Okay, well they saw that. <laughs> that whole mud covering was kind of pointless. <laughs> oh, there's his team. Sweet. Oh, we can see some vehicle action now, I hope. He got his little dune buggy. Now, I'll be honest, I haven't played that much Ghost Recon Wildlands. I played a bit when it came out, but I never really stuck around and played that much. Hopefully I can play this game a bit more, because it, it looks like a type of game I'd like to play. You've got squads, stealth, sick vehicles. I oh, was switching perspectives now to the uh, the uh, lady, I guess the sniper lady. Okay. So this is the compound I think they're going to break into and steal some, like, files. Oh, we've got a sniper. Oh, they're lining up to kill each other. That's cool. Nice. If they were going for a stealth approach, I think they kind of screwed up here. We got the woman coming in in the loud-ass vehicle. <laughs> Okay, they're taking like multiple different positions, yeah. I think this dude is the demolitionist. He's got like explosives, I think she's sort of like an all-rounder, and then the other guy is like a sniper. And then, obviously I think this is the dude you play as. Oh, he's got like a... Wire cutters? Yeah. Okay, so he's like cutting a... Square in the fence. No trespassing beyond this point. No drone zone. Alright, cool. This is cool. If you could do this to like any fence, that would be awesome. Ooh, stealthy. I'm sure there's multiple ways you could obviously infiltrate this compound if you could just go in guns blazing or go in stealthy like these guys are. There's probably multiple options you could choose from. Oh, he's putting on a suppressor. There we go. I was going to say, like, come on. If you're going to be stealthy, how are you going to do it without a suppressor? Little corner peek. There we go. Huh. Once again, this game looks fantastic. I really like it. like the look of it. I've noticed as well, if you are new to Ghost Recon, Wildlands, and Breakpoint, I guess, uh, you, you don't always, like, I guess, hit fire, sort of like the Division. It, you can aim down sights in first person, so it is kind of like, yeah, a first person shooter and a third person, I guess. You can switch between both, which is really good. Oh, she about to stealth crawl kill him. We got a demolitionist. Oh, there's two dudes over there with miniguns. They are not messing around. Stealth kill. What'd she do? Just kick him in the back of the kneecap. Oh, this dude's got... Yeah, he's about to take these dudes out with an RPG. We got our sniper loading up some bullets. That is some futuristic looking drone. That thing looks crazy. The actual big one, not the one he just threw. Ghost lead. We're set. Go, go. Ouch. That was tactical. Let's move quick and quiet. Quick and quiet. I think they removed the, the quiet. <laughs> Here we go. Oh. Rebel team. Move hostiles in 
inbound your location. Oh, okay. Oh my god, she just got shot with an RPG. Here we go. Did they did she just like walk up to that guy? Oh, she's like a knife expert. I see you. She's got that what's that knife called? It's got some fancy name, I can't remember. What is this? Some vehicle like printing factory? What? Is that that looks sick? Okay, that's cool. Whoa, what the hell? The animation was like clean. And to the roof. Oh my lord. This guy's having so much fun with his explosives. <laughs> I might have to try this guy out. I'm pretty sure you can customize your uh, character to like however you want. If you want to be like a sniper, a demolitionist. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's not set to like specific characters. Like you can, I guess, customize your loadout. This guy looks like he's got some sort of LMG on obviously a heavy rocket launcher. She's got some like knife and like sort of like a rifle build, I guess. UMP, I think that was, yeah. I guess these are making the vehicles for the baddies. Because this factory did look pretty, like, futuristic. Oh. oh god, she's got the minigun dude to deal with. What is that? It's like a drone. Uh-oh. Ooh, he's hit. That was some heavy drone. Oh my god. That drone's about to come up on him. What is that? Oh, she got a smoke bomb. That's cool. So yeah, she's definitely like the gadget lady. I'm pretty sure. She got like knives and gadgets. Oh, sniper. He got hurt pretty bad. There you go. Can heal up your teammates. Oh, and he's better. He is cured. <laughs> I love that in games. Oh, he's still a bit, still a bit limpy. I wonder if you get shot in the game, like that reflects on how you like move and stuff. Like if you get shot in the leg, you'll start limping and stuff. But yeah, that's been the gameplay, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, definitely leave a like on this video. Once again, thanks to Ubisoft for sponsoring this video. This has been my, I guess, live reaction Shit. to the gameplay. Um, obviously, we've got John Berthel right here. Pretty sure this is the dude from uh, Punisher, Walking Dead. Definitely go check out the uh, CGI trailer because it's, it's pretty crazy. Like, I watched it and I was like, wow, this is dope. Um, I'll leave a link to that in the video description. But yeah, right now in the background, you're just seeing, I guess, some... Uh, sort of like cutscenes on how they leave the building but I'm super excited to cover this game uh, once again if you'd like to win a copy of the game uh, feel free to leave a like on the video leave a comment uh, let's try and get this video to 3,000 likes that would be awesome and yeah I'll see you guys in my next video peace